Hey, you! Hey. Will, what are you doing here, buddy? Oh, uh, not much. Just checking up on my former store. I know. How's it look? Looking pretty yeah. nice. Dude, thanks. Sorry that uh, I can't be here long. I'm going to lunch, but uh, Mr. Castle's here, so why don't you talk to your old Excuse me, sir. Here. Hey there. All right, sounds good. Have a good lunch. You too. Thanks. What you looking for today, Mr. Rock Castle? Oh, I just need some new uh, new colors to offset the, the warm tones in my office. Warm tones in your office. Well, let's head right over here, and we'll check something out for you. All right. That's Italian silver. Italian silver. You just got it in. Yeah, never, uh, never held any of that stuff before. I know. I, know. Um, I have to go actually look at Mrs. Beneficio's house because I'm supposed to start on that. It's funny. She called you actually. Um, she said she just wanted you to come in. Here's an idea. I really miss this place. So why don't you go uh, finish the job and I'll watch the store for you. Yeah. Hey. How about it? I mean, I'm sure you have a lot of free time. How would you like to work here, just part time? Uh, you know what? I would love it. On one condition, yeah. though. I'm going to need a month of vacation every year. That's a deal. All right, man. All right. All right, I'll see you. If anything happens, give me a call. The store is in good control. I'm sure of it. Welcome to Chapter 11. Chapter 11 is all about a merchandising corporation and how they deal with payroll. This is how to process payroll manually. To start, go up to Help. Select QuickBooks Help. Select Search and type in Process Payroll Manually. Once you have searched that, select the first option. With that being done, select Manual Payroll Calculation. Scroll down to the bottom and select Set My Company File to use Manual Calculations. Click OK. And now you can see that you have new titles in your Employees section. Now when paying employees, we have to do it manually, so go down to Pay Employees. Oh, just select No right here. Now go to Payroll Setup. Now it's a pretty big step, so I'm going to skip it all. You guys will have to figure it out for yourselves, but it's not hard. Just follow the steps. After it's all said and done, now you'll be able to create payroll by yourself. This is the employee center for Will Miles. And now that you have payroll set up manually, you can do it on your own terms at any time you need. To print paychecks, click Pay Employees under the Employee section. Then select the employee to be paid and click continue. Next, click open paycheck detail and in the employee summary section enter amounts for federal withholding, social security, and medicare. In the company summary enter the amounts for social security and medicare and click save and close. This shows the employee's gross pay and amounts deducted for tax. Click on create paychecks then click print paychecks Select the paycheck to be printed, click OK, and then click Print. Click on the Pay Liabilities in the Employee section, select your date range, and click OK. Now if there are any liabilities, select them. Click Create. That's it for Chapter 11. I'll see you in Chapter 12. Oh, uh, Rock Castle, how can I help you? It's -a me, a Tomasol! Oh, hey, Tom So. How are you? Hey, doing? How are you? Pretty good. How's your brother doing? Oh, Luigi is doing great. <laughs> How's your other brother doing? Oh, Tony is doing awesome. Oh, I man, I thought it was Mario. Oh, Mario is awesome. Oh, you have another one. How can I help you today, buddy? Ah, uh, Sophia! She's not on the payroll! Oh, I'm sorry. You want me to add her? Yes. Alright, I will get that done immediately. If you need anything else, just let me know, alright? Okay. Tom, so